we're in the middle of the construction of the flying machine and we've been adding the detail to the rocket. Um, all these little panels and straps um, and we're going to add rivets to those later. Uh, before I do that, um, I've got the gingerbread glued here to the tube and it's hard to see but it's there. Uh, but I haven't done the nose cone yet. Um, and the reason is these I applied using wood glue. Uh, when I do the nose cone, I'm going to use um, super glue. And the reason is that uh, wood glue is water based and so it doesn't stick to the plastic well, but super glue will. So to, to apply them, first put your nose cone on. Um, and it's going to be important that the nose cone be in the same spot because Whenever you put these down, they're not going to be perfect. So to get to get them to line up every time, um, I'm just going to put a line across here on the nose cone, and then I'm going to tape it just to make sure that it doesn't move around on me. And I'll remove the tape when I get to that point. Um, let me do this big one because it's a little easier to see. So I'm going to lay the top part on the edge of the two on the edge of the um, nose cone. So now I moved it. The tape was supposed to prevent me from doing that and it did. I pulled it right off. So I was going to line up just like that and I'm going to need my glasses. I got a little plastic bag so I can smooth out the super glue. Um, and I'm using super thin, water thin super glue. And I'm going to put it on the surface and then press it down with the plastic bag so it doesn't stick to my fingers. And once I got it one corner down, it's not going anywhere. I can't move it around. So then I can, here's where I'm going to take that off. I don't want to glue the tube. I don't want to glue, yeah, the tube. <laughs> The tube onto the nose cone. So uh, I'll just remove it and then wick it down, uh, wick it in, press it down. And just keep going around. Enough glue penetrates the, I need a paper towel, penetrates the paper that it will stick down. So even though it's hanging up right now, as soon as I press it down, the glue will wick through the fibers of the paper and attach it to the tube. See, now it's, now it's up, or now it's pressed down. Got that little corner. If you get too much, just wipe it off and press it down. If it doesn't stick down, now you got to put a little bit under the underside. Just like that. So that one's on. And we'll put it back into the tube. Line that up. And sure enough, it comes out a line there. Let that little piece of tape go. And now I can do the next one. Same process. First, line it up. And I'm going to do the, the nose of it. Remove the tape, slide it out so that I don't accidentally glue it into the tube. 
and then wick some CA onto it. Let's see if I can do it all in one, one step here. That edge came up a little bit, so I'll just put a little glue under it, wipe it off, press it down. All right, so I got two of them on, that one and that one, and I'll go ahead and do the other two. Um, and then in our next step, we'll again ply the rivet, uh, rivets. Uh, you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Um, also watch these other videos over here. I think you're going to enjoy them until the next one in this series comes out. Um, if you're watching on YouTube, the comments are below and the subscribe button to the Apogee channel. Um, this is the Apogee Rocketry Workshop. Our website is www.apogeerockets.com. May the winds be light, may the skies be blue, may all your rockets fly straight and true.